Hi, something a bit different here. Um, probably won't interest many of you. But, uh, I thought I'd do it anyway. Anyway, I was tidying up the cellar and I found all these uh, little Japanese uh, Gashapon capsules. Which I remember buying. I think I got them from Hong Kong years ago. So this is the uh, Sega History Collection. Got them all there. So first one, little Dreamcast. Quite detailed actually for what they are. Uh, so yeah, side comes off, and I'm not sure whether anyone remembers them, but this was an additional sort of like 56k modem unit that uh, plugged into the side. So they all open, obviously don't work. But, uh, <laughs> great if they did, wouldn't they? Little CD there. So you can put the CD in. There's the uh, Dreamcast controller. See how small they are. I mean, definitely thumb sized. I'll plug that in there. I'm not sure if anyone remembers the uh, the Dreamcast, but I used to get the VMUs, which was the uh, Sega's visual memory units. Had a little LCD screen on, which just gave extra information really for the game that you're playing and in some games you could download mini games to these so top comes off there's actually two of these and you'll be amazed so say you downloaded one of the games and you wanted to share it with someone you basically just plug them together like that and the game transferred across it's just quite uh, quite astonishing for the time. Batteries didn't last by the way. And uh, there you go. Pop Bob the memory unit in the uh, in the controller. So uh, I think it's just basically the size of them is just uh, pretty darn impressive to be honest. There you go, so that's the uh, Dreamcast. Got a selection of Mega Drive bits here. You'll have to bear with me. I'll get them all out. I've not actually opened all of these. Um, I probably shouldn't. But to be honest, I probably will. There you go. So I've not actually uh, done these yet. So Mega CD sticker that I've not put on yet so that'll go on the go on the little CD there as a case there's the stickers for the case so let's see what we've got So there's the original Mega Drive that was released. Uh, tiny, tiny controller. There you go. Same with all the other ones. You can uh, plug them in. So that's that. Let's get myself sorted out. Right, so here's the uh, Sega Master System add-on. So you can just pop that in the top there. So that enables you to play uh, Master System games on the, on the Mega Drive. So, little cartridge for the Mega Drive there. Quite amazing actually, and the little cartridge slot opens at the top there. Uh, got reset button, and that was for the uh, for the games that came on the uh, on the sort of like I don't know, they were like SMC cards really, memory cards. 
that's that one. You can bob that out there. Here we've got the Mega CD add-on, which went uh, with the CD that I've not done yet. There you go. Drawer opens, you can bob the CD in. And uh, obviously if you're, you're aware, and uh, that just fitted on the top. Like that. And then the final bit. is the uh, Sega 32X add-on so that plugs in and it goes and a uh, little cartridge to go with it and you also get the digital controller for that one there you go so that's a mega drive right I've not these that I'm going to look at now I've never actually opened like I said, I probably shouldn't do it, but uh, what the hell? Never looked at them. Probably just halving value, you know. Haven't I? So. so there you go. So uh, as a Sega Master System, let's see what we've got with this. So, got two controllers with it. You have to bear with me because I don't actually know what these uh, what these are. Looks like the stickers for the controllers. There's one of the uh, memory cards with the game on it. I can't read. So, uh, obviously they just slotted in the front there. And uh, here's a game. Won't be able to read it, but uh, there you go. That slots in the top. There you go. Sega Master System. Right, I think we're getting on to. Um, I think one of these is sort of like. Japanese release only, so I'm probably not entirely sure what it is, but uh, let's look at this one. Yeah, again, probably just halved the value of this. Here we go, Sega Saturn, which I have got one of. So, uh, CD case, little CD. Street Fighter 2 sticker for the CD and Street Fighter 2 sticker for the case. Doesn't seem quite as well finished off this one for some reason. So I've got the controller there, pop that in the front. If it'll go, see what I mean? It's, uh, all the others are quite good quality apart from this one. Yeah, not not brilliant. Seems a bit rough around the edges. So as per usual, the uh, the top opens to put the CD in, and then down the back. slot that's where the memory card went in memory expansion so there you go Sega Saturn that's that right this is the last one which I'm not entirely sure about probably should have read up on it but, uh, I think this I think this one was some sort of I think it was some sort of console but it was more along a computer line if you get what I mean so let's see what this is 
controls already uh, in. Oh yeah. So this is the uh, Sega Mark III, which is definitely, definitely Japanese release only. Don't think I've ever seen one of these before. Just wonder what this flap is. What's this flap? Does it open? Or I'm going to break it? Nope. Oh, nearly. There you go. So there's the flap. So like I said, I haven't got a clue what this is. Uh, what's that say? FM sound unit. So I'm guessing. Is that plug in there? Nope. Is this game plug in there? Let's give it a try. The game plugs in there, a bit tight. Uh, a lot. Another memory card game there. That's that. Not sure what that piece is, unless it's. Uh, Take these controllers off a minute. Is it for the front? Let's give it a go. Possibly. Not sure what that's for though. And uh, yeah, this FM sound unit. Not. Does it go in there? Yes. That fits on there. And does it plug in the back? I think it does. A bit tight now. The only thing that's left now is this uh, ribbon cable, which I haven't got a clue where it goes. Is it? Ha! Ah. So, take that bit off. fits in there so like I said I've never actually seen one of these before uh, obviously Japanese only release but, uh, there you go so that's the uh, Sega Gashapon history collection like I said a little bit different uh, but there you go thanks for watching